Hello YouTube people, you gave me a question, very good question by the way, which is how this parness, golden parness looks like on leather straps, because in the original review of this watch I haven't included wrist shots how it looks on leather straps, but the reason for that is because this watch looks so good on its original bracelet that I haven't even bothered. But anyway, let's have some fun. Let's put this watch on some different straps. Let's see how it looks like. By the way, I have this little setup outside uh, of my mom's garden. <laughs> so here is the table with a lot of straps. The mirror, we're gonna do some shots how it looks like in the mirror. So yeah, let's have some fun. So I have this very interesting angle. I can show you the watch in a shade. I can show you the watch in a direct sunlight in the mirror. But also I can show you how it looks like from the first person view. So let's start with the original bracelet because it looks just so good. It's so good. It's incredible. But I clearly understand that some people may not like wearing a watch on a bracelet because leather straps still feel a little bit better on the wrist, more comfortable than, than this loose bracelet. The first one is just simple leather strap, very comfortable and it also has golden buckle so it's like looks looks original very nice i still prefer the bracelet but i i wouldn't say that it looks bad on this black leather strap still nice still nice doesn't look custom looks original and that's important okay next one let's try something brown maybe so all other straps I have are on stainless steel hardware, sorry for that. But you're still gonna get a general look how the watch looks like. So this is brown strap with holes. It's very good in the summer. I have worn this strap quite a lot on many different watches. I like it a lot. By the way, I'll put the link, a lot of links in the description to these straps. So you can find them on Aliexpress if you want. This one is very good by the way. Feels very comfy. I'm not sure if the brown strap looks okay with golden watch. I'm not sure. I wouldn't wear it like that. I just don't like the look. It doesn't look bad, but somehow I I don't know. It's not my my style. It's it's like it lacks some kind of contrast or something interesting. Anyway, let's try another strap. Now this is the last brown strap I'm gonna show you on this watch. This is the dark, dark one and it does look pretty good with this watch. It originally came with white stitches as well but I changed them to the black ones because I just don't like white stitches somehow. And it, it, do, it looks pretty good. Not as good as on the bracelet obviously but I mean I mean it's not bad, it's not bad. I do wear my stainless steel version of this watch on this strap quite often. It's very comfy. Also you're gonna find the link in the description but you can buy it only with white stitches. So it, it's gonna look a little bit sportier than, than this one. Now this is the same strap except it is blue, also came with white stitches but I changed them to black as well. And in my opinion gold looks better on blue strap than it looks on a brown somehow. Uh, on a brown golden watch looks like it's very old watch somehow in, in a bad way but on a blue strap it looks fresh. Somehow it looks youthful. <laughs> looks fresh. I, I I don't know how good those shots gonna come out in the video. I really hope you're gonna see that. Because it does look really good actually. This leather strap is very nice. It's very nice leather strap. So yeah, let's take time. Let's take a bit of look from the distance. I can't twist my wrist anymore, sorry. <laughs> this is all I can do. 
all the way to this side, all the way to this side. <laughs> now, what if you want to go for a swim with this watch? Because this watch is 50 meters water resistant after all. And I do actually swim with my stainless steel version. So you may gonna put this watch on a silicone strap. I do put my stainless steel version on silicone straps when I go for a swim with that watch. It's, you know, it has screw down case back, screw down crown, and I have lubricated all those places. So I have been swimming with my stainless steel version parnis quite quite many times actually. Hmm. So this one is also blue, but this one is a little bit more saturated. A little bit brighter blue. Looks very playful. It does look very playful. That's how it looks in the shadow and that's in a direct sunlight. Very comfy by the way. If I'll find the link uh, on Aliexpress where I bought this silicone strap I will put the link in the description because this one feels wonderful because it has holes on both sides so on a hot day the wrist doesn't get sweaty it's very breathable and super comfy very very good strap this one is and it's not expensive I paid like I don't remember but something like 5 euros or something like that and they do last quite a long time very good strap this is grey fabric strap some kind of textile very similar to car seat belt I would say but it's a, a little bit softer and it's it's actually very comfortable on the wrist this one I'll also put the link in the description if I can find the link of course <laughs> but I do wear this strap on many watches rather often because it's just very comfortable and on a hot summer day uh, the wrist doesn't get sweaty so yeah highly recommend it looks very nice on many watches because it's it's just very neutral any color watch any size of shape it just looks good on any watch this one is no exception it just it's just I don't know it's nice it's unoffensive it's very neutral as I said and it's very very comfy now this one sporty nylon two-piece nylon strap with this black hardware on a golden watch um, technically it shouldn't be right but visually it does look nice <laughs> surprisingly I like it I mean after all it's a sporty watch right on a sporty nylon strap it's fine it is fine come on I really hope those shots in the video gonna come up nice because it does look really good in person now this one I'm really not sure about <laughs> golden watch on a red strap interesting very striking and I would say looks very feminine maybe well very strong very strong image I personally wouldn't wear it like that probably maybe uh, I don't know sometimes I am in a crazy mood I would do that but definitely not often not often at all so what if we take red strap and add three black stripes on it that's how it would look like still no less striking than the full red one very playful though does look very playful now let's put the golden one next to the stainless steel version and honestly if I could choose only one I would go for the stainless steel version because it is well it's more durable if you're gonna scratch it there's gonna be just another stainless steel color 
under the scratch but if you're gonna scratch the golden one you're gonna see the stainless steel under the coating uh, under this golden coating but let's be honest with this golden watch you ain't gonna do some kind of manual labor or such anyway both watches look incredible but I personally prefer the stainless steel version it is more versatile feels more robust that I can scratch it and it I'm gonna change the color it I'm gonna wear out or anything like that and I do somehow prefer the dial of the stainless steel version it's just I don't know this monotone look I, I like it a lot you know what let's put it on the wrist so just for the comparison this is the stainless steel version it looks incredible come on it's just such a nice watch in my opinion this is probably the best looking watch I ever had probably but very very close it does compete with several other watches but it's definitely competing for the number one position in terms how beautiful it is very very beautiful bracelet as well this is the only watch that I actually wear on a bracelet I'm not a bracelet guy I don't really like bracelets leather straps or nylon straps are way comfortable for me but it looks so good with this original bracelet I, that I just don't even bother so now let's quickly swap to the golden one just for the comparison and back to the golden one also very very beautiful watch very very beautiful watch they're very close to each other in terms of the beauty really it just depends on your mood how you feeling that day are you feeling like wearing stainless steel version watch or like a golden one i mean yeah anyway thank you for asking this very good question how it looks like on different leather straps and such i hope i have answered this question well in this video so yeah i hope this video helps thank you for watching goodbye